Listen, I don't know what it is when it comes to the black church, what I do. And Ian LaVanzant, y'all give us so much issue. I think that's the reason why when she called into my show, she was going off because she already felt like I done had enough of these Christian black church people. So these pictures hit the internet. In Maryland, she is ordaining a female apostle. It's an affirmation service. And she's one of the people who are actually anointing with oil. And I guess she's speaking prophetically or she's praying or something like that. And people have a serious problem with it. Saying that she's a witch, she's this, she's that. It reminds me of some of the Beyonce stuff because she tends to honor African spirituality. Let me tell you something that you did not know. That our Christianity, the Abrahamic religions, and so much more come out of African spirituality. African spirituality is just this. Pure African spirituality is just this. Number one, honor God. And then you're supposed to develop a very close and real relationship with him. Number two is have a good relationship with the people that came before you, all of your ancestors and things of that nature. And number three, that you're supposed to have a good relationship with your family, which some of y'all are fucking up. Mm -hmm. You don't want to talk about that, do you? Just go to the church and preach and sing and holler and cuss your mama out all at the same time. But anyway, wait. And number four, I have a good relationship with the community. And you do know that's what holiness is. <laughs> that's a whole nother lesson. I ain't got time to teach y'all. And then lastly, honor and have knowledge about nature. All of the herbs, the ground, all that kind of going on, the interaction and exchange. That's African spirituality. That's it. It was European spirituality, a.k.a. European white Christianity that a whole lot of us over here in the West don't even realize that we have allowed master, that's right, from the plantation to just rob our ancestors of their spirituality, to snatch the stuff that they wanted to use and create this whole stuff and we just drank it down. But that's why I always tell people, your Jesus got blue eyes and white skin. Mine, mine is looking like me. Nappy hair. And like collets and ham hock and stuff like that. He ain't on time. Mm -mm. He be late. But he gonna get there. That's the Jesus that I serve. <laughs>